G'day, welcome to another episode of Country Life on the Coast. In today's episode, we're going to pull apart a clock radio. So we have here a Sanyo clock radio. The clock component of it works, but the radio component works sometimes. It seems to have trouble tuning in and also the volume level varies at times all by itself without me touching it. So I'm hoping it's a fairly simple fix, but we'll pull it apart and see what we find. So just a quick example of what it's doing. Okay, so first thing, make sure it's unplugged. We don't want any electricity coming to it. We want to be safe. So it looks like we just have four screws holding it on. So we'll take those out. With the problem I'm having with it, I'm thinking that either with this tuning dial or the volume dial, there's basically just a build up of dust or fluff or something in there. And so what I'd like to be able to do is get into it uh, and be able to spray some contact cleaner in there to clean it up. So I might try and undo these couple of screws to remove this circuit board up. and be able to get a bit better access in there. So I just have some electrical contact cleaner. Safe on most electrical components, so we should be fine. I'm just gonna spray that in here, but it's difficult to see where what we're looking at. up the excess. <laughs> what I might also do is uh, get some compressed air and just blow on it which will remove any other bits and pieces that might be there that we don't want there and um, also dry out any excess contact cleaner that's sitting there as well that we don't want to remain
Well, that was a bit tricky. Certainly using the screwdriver there just to help that guide in to the right tabs was the trick. All right, guys, well, we've got this back together and not that I can really uh, play the music on here, but I'm now able to um, adjust it and hear stuff clearly. So it was just like I thought, just had to use a bit of contact cleaner and get it in there so that it uh, cleared out any dust or whatever it was that was there. Sprayed it dry, put it back together, and I now have a clock radio that works again, which means I can use the alarm in the morning and wake myself up, which would be good. There we go, guys. So we've got my clock radio working. Not that difficult, but it's one of those things that I use all the time. And I like to actually try fix things rather than just throw it out and buy something new. So that's what we're all about. Give it a go. Worst case scenario, well, you have to buy something new if that be the case. But hey, we've got that one fixed, so we'll be happy. But that's all we've got in this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit that like and subscribe button, and we'll catch you next time. God bless.